Welcome to the V1200 HD Multiview and Crosspoint Setup Tutorial. Let's take a look at how you set this up. So in the root menu, select Multiview 1. As you can see, we have a 16 channel layout, as well as two large windows on top, two large windows on the bottom. Let's show you what that looks like. Currently, right now, let's go to the 16 window layout. I'm going to switch over to that and you can see the 16 window layout. When I switched the two on large ones on top, it switches, the two large ones on the bottom, it switches. Again, let's just talk briefly about how you do your label setups on your multi-view. Hit label, maybe SDI one, I want that to be um, cam one. All right, hit enter. Maybe SDI two is gonna be Overhead. Let's hit clear. And then I hit enter and close. So now I'm labeling my SDI inputs, maybe HDMI 1. Instead of HDMI 1, we want to label it Mac. Hit enter. So now I'm labeling my channels. So that's how quickly and easily you can assign labels to your not only your cross points down here but also in your multi-view window. And then on ME2, there's a different multi-view window layout as well. I'm gonna show you a larger version of that so you can see. Uh, you can see they have a quad view, um, two larger windows on the top and eight on the bottom. Um, you also have eight on top and two larger windows on the bottom as well. All right, so let's talk about cross points. These are your cross points on the controller. Um, currently, right now, I have my cameras here and then my computers over here. But maybe I want my computers on the on one and two because I, I switch those a lot. So I'm going to go to my XPT, which is my assignable cross point. And right now it's assigned to SDI1. Maybe I want to assign that to my Mac. So now it's going to be assigned to the Mac. And now my uh, instead of SDI2, I want an HDMI2. Maybe that's my secondary computer as well. So now when I close the bottom, as you can see, my assignable cross points have now changed. So this is set up for my uh, Macintosh computer. And then my camera's next. So the cool thing about the assignable cross points is you can put it in any order that you want and how you want it to mix. So there you have it. You're all set up for the multi-view windows as well as your assignable cross points.